I think what's important for us is that our viewers understand each of the terms, because we're talking about these terms in the interviews, and I just want to be able to illustrate that. Okay. When we talk about impact spatter, what does that mean? Impact spatter is force applied to liquid blood. So I'm going to pour some of our artificial blood here into my hand, and I'm going to punch it, and that's force going into a blood source. The force impacts the blood, and the blood spatters. Yes, and then the blood breaks up into smaller drops. It's impact. That's one way blood gets out. You can see how it's, it's radiating out. We have some smaller stains with some directionality up to the top. What's cast off? Cast is a result of a bloody object in motion. So cast off is if I keep the blood that's on my hand and I fling my hand like that. Those larger stains are in what I would call kind of a linear fashion and they're all going, you can see the directionality, they're going up the wall. Because when you cast off the blood, it was moving in an upward direction? Yes. So we have cast off, we have impact. What's the other stains that we were looking at? What's transfer staining? So I have a, a bloody surface coming in contact with a non-bloodied surface and then I, I move my hand. So it's called a, a swipe. It's a bloodied surface with a non-bloody surface with movement. And now again, I can see something contacted the wall. Transfer, you have impact, you have cast off, all different ways in which blood may end up at the scene. Yes. And each one of these will tell a different part of the story. Yes, when studied properly, I take the size of the pattern, uh, the overall location in the room, how many stains I'm seeing, their overall distribution, the average size of each of those stains, all of those come into play. The idea of conducting experiments in which you might cast off blood or try to produce an impact spatter, the idea of all of that is to try to see what kind of fit there is between the stains created the spatter created, and the facts of the account that you've been presented. Yeah, I think it's responsible to conduct experiments in, in your scene. And if I can recreate it, then I'm putting that as a viable option for how that blood was deposited at the scene.